Thank you for installing Docent EDU. I'm Matt. I'm Karen. And we're co-founders of Docent EDU and high school teachers. Now, let's make a lesson. Go to a web page you would like to assign to your class, click on the Docent EDU extension, and the toolbar will show up on the left side. The first tool is the highlighter. This is an easy way to bring important text to your students' attention. Below that is the note tool, which works in conjunction with the highlighter. Click on any highlighted text to add a simple note for your students, such as a definition. Students can click on any underlined highlight to view your note. You can delete highlights by selecting the highlight tool and then click and hold on the highlighted text. The next tool is the sticky, and this is one I use a lot with my classes because it's so versatile. Select the tool and then click any paragraph to which you would like to add more interactivity. St sticky notes are like notes on steroids. Besides text, you can paste in YouTube videos, grab more information from the internet with an embed code like vocab quizzes, simulations, graphs, maps, and more. We have a growing list of things you can utilize with the sticky in our resources page. Delete stickies by clicking on the X in the upper right. Now it's time for some awesome and our inspiration for founding Docent EDU. Asking questions anywhere you want right in the text. Select the question tool and then click any paragraph where you want to ask a question. Type in the question, assign points, and click create. Now your students can see your questions and answer them right in the actual text of the website. Student responses are auto-saved and we'll show you how grading is done in just a few seconds. To delete a question, click on edit and then delete. The final mind-blowingly cool tool is the discussion tool. This works like a question, but now students can view other students' responses. Discussions are not graded so as to encourage sharing of ideas and are a great way to kickstart face-to-face discussions in your classroom. Wow, that was fast! You've now created an interactive lesson based on an authentic, relevant text for your class. To assign your pedagogical gold, click on the Docent EDU icon at the top of the toolbar and select a class. You can always add more classes in the dashboard, which we'll get to next. First, though, we want to show you the feedback tool. We're in beta right now, and that means hearing from educators and students is very important to us. If you ever have a question or have a suggestion, just click on the feedback button on the bottom of the toolbar and tell us how we can help. It will directly send us an email so we can help you ASAP. Now, let's grade and view your lessons by going to the dashboard. From here, you can view and assign existing lessons or docents, as we like to call them. In the classes section, you can view the rosters of existing classes. Click on the plus to create a new class. Once students install docent EDU, you can give them this unique class code so they can enroll themselves in your class. If you have a projector in your class, click on the binoculars so e and students in the back of the class without glasses know what it is. For students to view the, your docent, simply direct them to the original online text and have them click on the docent extension and they're ready to go. Grading is efficient because it was designed by teachers for teachers. Select the class and docent to grade and then whether you want to grade by question or by student. It's up to you to decide what makes sense for each lesson. Thanks for watching our tutorial and don't hesitate to ask for help and be sure to check out our resources page for free quality text to use with Dolson EDU and tools to embed.